25 or 30 minutes for Edgewood. Uh, yeah. Andrew, ahead of you, uh, getting up and down from everywhere for a variety of scores. And then you finished birdie birdie. Yeah. Uh, what was? Uh, we saw your shot here on nine, but what what got into you at the end of your round? And did you feel you needed to kind of salvage something today? Well, you know, I was grinding the whole day. I had a, I had a bad situation on 17. I had to take a double, and you know. you know, towards the end I was eight over or so, and I was like, I need some birdies, so. Luckily, I made some birdies. I don't know if it was all skill. It was a couple good putts, but it turned out to be okay round for how bad I played. What was the issue on 17? Was it something you were near the hazard, or where were you? Yeah, my ball plugged uh, on the right bunker, and the rules official didn't really know what was up, so I ended up going back to the tee and reteeing it and making a good two putt for five. <laughs> <laughs> and obviously, in a state tournament, you have to shake that kind of stuff off. How did you manage to do it? Where did you get going again? Uh, I don't know. I just tried to make pars at the most, mm -hmm. and that's just kept me in it, sort of. What was the situation on eight? How did you make birdie there? Uh, you know, my coach told me the club selection was, like, wrong with everybody, but he was like, this, this is the right situation. So I hit eight iron and made a long putt for birdie. So. Okay. And then here, what did you have in your hand uh, to, to knock it up that close from how far? Well, I was guessing it was playing about 170 uphill into the wind, so I hit 7 iron, and luckily I hit it close and made it easy birdie. Yeah, nice way to finish, um, and now uh, we don't know what this weather delay means, but for you guys to finish strong, does it give you some momentum going into tomorrow? Um, you'll probably see, if you haven't been told already, Lodi is off to a pretty good start, yeah, but uh, obviously they've got to finish it off now, and, and who knows you know, how late or early tomorrow. Uh, I think... Uh, we just play our own game tomorrow, go out and shoot a low number, and maybe we have a chance. What's made Lodi so tough, and are you surprised that they've come on as strong as they have here late in the season? Uh, I'm not surprised because I'm buddies with a couple of them, and they're all pretty good golfers. I think they were underrated the whole season, but they're tough. Uh, we'll just have to go play our game and see what happens tomorrow. And on that note of thunder, <laughs> sleep well on that, okay? Uh, thanks, thanks, Ben.